kiss the way that you left me Sat beside in your car in the backseat Wide awake is the way that you left me, oh Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Julianne and today's video is going to be a declutter, organize, and clean with me. If you guys have some cleaning and organizing you need to get done, let's go ahead and tackle it together. This is my second video in kind of this series. I am working on one to two rooms a week and I'm going to be decluttering, organizing, and cleaning the rooms really good. So if you guys want to get in on those videos, make sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell notification so you never miss out on another video. So first we are going to be starting out in my bathroom and I am going to just be cleaning it. Here I'm using the Branch Basics bathroom cleaner and to clean the mirror I did use the Spray Away Cleaner. We will be getting into the decluttering and organizing about halfway through this video and I will make sure to have it time stamped for you guys in case you guys only want to be here for that decluttering, organizing, and cleaning. Here I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how dirty this glass is in my shower and then I'm going to give you guys an after shot once I am finished cleaning it. I am going to use the Dawn Power Wash and a Scrub Daddy sponge and I just want to show you guys how good of a job that it really does. Let me know in the comments what you guys are up to today, if you guys are cleaning with me or if you guys are tackling something on your to-do list. guys so here is the after it does such a good job i love the dawn power wash it is definitely one of my favorite cleaners let me know in the comments below if you guys have tried it out and what you guys think all right so there wasn't too much to do in the bathroom i actually had to completely clean and bleach my bathroom just a few days ago because my little one Camila she did end up getting sick and um, yeah we definitely needed to bleach the entire bathroom so it wasn't too bad now we are moving into the bedroom and I did just wash my sheets and my blanket so I am going to go ahead and get this bed made and if you guys see Mickey there I'm trying to tell him that I'm trying to make the bed but he listens about as well as my children do so so you would say yeah I don't see the logic of things It's quite a lonely world that we're living in Oh baby, you are something special, I'm sure Everything makes total sense when you're next to me So here I'm going to use the Method All-Purpose Cleaner to wipe down my furniture. As you guys can see, I am almost out. I really do like this all-purpose cleaner, but if you guys have an all-purpose cleaner that you think I need to try out, let me know in the comments and I will definitely go ahead and try that. Even if I told you I could never let you go I'm not so sure you believe me 
But if I mean to show you, I will never let you go. No, cause you don't see the logic of things. It's quite a lonely world that we're living in. Oh, baby, you are something special, I'm sure. Everything makes total sense when you're next to me. So of course I had a ton of stuff piled up on the chair that I have in my room so I'm going to go ahead and get that folded and put away. So now I'm going to go ahead and vacuum. From the first time I saw ya, you were not like the others. A cool kind of melody. You rattled my cage without warning, kept it up right till the morning. A new kind of ecstasy. You found a different side of me, the one I'd like to be. A different side of me, yeah. So I do vacuum my room quite often, but it gets super, super dusty in my room. And look at all that stuff. I'm always so amazed by how much junk is like on my floors. Here, I'm going to go ahead and use this for breeze. I love this scent. I think it is just ocean and it smells so good. It's definitely my favorite scent from Febreze. I'm super excited to be partnering with Homey Kitchen in today's video. Homey's dishcloths are perfect for every surface, spill, or situation. They are eco-friendly, 100% plant-based, machine washable, and 100% biodegradable material. They are an awesome green alternative to paper towels with one reusable cleaning cloth doing the work of 15 paper towel rolls. I'm going to show you guys how I use them to wash dishes, clean the countertops, and kitchen table I will have all their information in the description box below and make sure to use code Julie 10 for 10% off they also host giveaways promotions and discounts every third of the month to everyone who subscribe to their email list and they'll also throw in something extra special for their mailer subscribers So as you guys can see, I am washing the dishes and it is doing an awesome job even getting all that gross egg stuff off of the pan. I have been using these for the last few days and I was really impressed with how well that it does on my quartz. Sometimes things leave my quartz very, very streaky. So I was a little hesitant, but y'all, it did an awesome job. No streaking and it even got a ton of paint off of Camila's high chair. I had let the kids use green paint to paint earlier in that day and typically it is super hard to get the paint off of that high chair but it came right off i'm telling you guys if you are looking for a green and eco-friendly product for an alternative to paper towels this is definitely such a good option so make sure to head down to my description box once you're finished with this video and make sure to go check them out and even if you don't purchase something make sure to go ahead and sign up for their email list so you can be entered in for those giveaways The one I'd like to be a different side of me, yeah. So to clean my sink, I did just use the Dawn Power Wash and that homey dishcloth. Now I'm going to go ahead and clean my countertops. I am using the Method Granite Cleaner with that dishcloth again, and I feel like it does such a good job. There was no streaks on my countertops. I'm falling behind, falling behind, I hate to separate my body and mind, my body and mind. Ooh, ooh, I feel like, ooh, ooh, I feel like demons in my mind, demons, demons in my mind. Ooh, ooh, it tastes like, ooh, ooh, it tastes like demons in my mind, demons pushing all my triggers. 
Now I'm going to go ahead and wipe down my kitchen table. It is super gross, so I am just using some dish soap with that dishcloth again. So now I'm quickly going to go ahead and wipe down these chairs. I am just going to show you guys wiping down a few of them because I know it can get a little bit repetitive and boring to watch me clean the same thing over and over again. And my floors are pretty gross as usual, so we are going to go ahead and vacuum them and then we are going to steam mop. But I know I'm not over you Keep missing our fights Think I'm losing my mind But I guess that's what love do So I love my couch, but I think the next time I purchase a couch, I will do a couch that goes all the way to the floor because I am so tired of having to get underneath this couch and get everything out. Between the kids and Mickey, there is always just a disgusting mess underneath my couch. It's the way that it moves and the way that it laughs So I can't get enough Think about him all the time I can get him off my mind Oh, I want him to be mine, to be mine My heart is saying yeah, 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 yeah You know I want him now, 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 now My heart is saying yeah, 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 yeah all right, so the last thing that we are going to be doing out here is steam mopping and then we are going to get into Owen's room, which is just a complete disaster. If you guys were here for like the last few videos, you guys may remember that I mentioned that Owen, um, one day he went into his room, dumped all his toys on his floor. He refused to help pick the toys up, so I actually put them in garbage bags. I told him that he could get his toys back whenever he decided that he was ready to help me put them away. And honestly, they had just been sitting in trash bags in my hallway for a long time. And so now that I'm doing this huge declutter, I decided to go ahead and just go through his toys, get rid of the ones that I know he doesn't play with, and just organize the ones that we are going to be keeping. And guys, I'm getting rid of so much stuff. I cannot wait to show you guys the after. But also, if you guys can see on my TV, I am watching Mulan, the new one that just came out and it is so good if you guys haven't watched it yet i highly suggest it such a good movie typically i'm really not into those types of disney movies but i loved it i thought it was such a good movie all right guys so this is what we're starting with those are the trash bags of toys that i was actually just talking about and i have some of my organizing containers his closet is just a mess right now. There's just junk and all kinds of stuff. So first I'm going to go ahead and start out with washing his sheets. Yeah. 
So I have been wanting to declutter and organize for such a long time, but I really do put like monetary value onto things. Like I look at it as I worked hard to pay for this item, so I feel I should keep this item. I don't wanna just give it away or throw it away or you know, whatever you wanna do with it. It's, it's hard and if you do wanna sell things, it takes a lot of effort to sell it, to list it, post it, you know, take pictures and do all that, especially for kids' toys and clothing. I mean, honestly, they're just worth a dime a dozen. It doesn't really give you the kind of payout that is worth it to go through all of those steps. But I'm going to tell you guys that once you get started, it gets so much easier to just make those bags of donations and just get rid of them. Once it's out of your house, y'all, you're not gonna think about it. You're not gonna sit around and be like, wow, I really wish I had that like, you know, stuffed animal or this or that. And your kids are never going to think about it either. These toys had been sitting for over two weeks, y'all. And Owen never asked for them. He did not care about those toys. And that is what really pushed me to do this was because I mean, if he didn't care about these toys, then why am I hoarding them and keeping them? I just need to be much more mindful about the things that I'm bringing into my house from now on. So if you guys are at that space right now, go ahead and get started. I promise the more you do it, the easier it will get. Not saying that I wasn't overwhelmed in this video because y'all, I was overwhelmed. I took breaks, I turned the camera off and just did my own thing. But once I finished, I felt so good. And I honestly can't wait to do the rest of my house. But we both know that when it gets late, one call away and then you are spending the night. So these bins that I'm using, I picked up from Ikea for $5 and I'm just going to be putting them into his closet, but I absolutely love them and I think that they're such a great buy for $5. So here is what I came up with for his toys. We have like little people, we have dinosaurs, I have his little Mickey train, I have um, some cars and some Legos and the wood toys I'm actually going to be moving and putting them into a different box because I didn't have enough room in um, this little area of his closet to put five bins. So I'm actually going to be probably going back to Ikea and getting some more of these bins because I do have um, a closet in my hallway that I also want to organize. So now I'm going to go ahead and move out his bed. Of course, we just have a bunch of junk that was underneath of the bed back here and we're gonna go ahead and get that all cleaned out. Loving me was all you tried when you were around. I've been told too many times now. Yeah, loving me was all you tried when you were around. All right, y'all, so we are about halfway through. I just wanted to show you guys what we are working with. It is just a complete disaster, but I promise that we are getting somewhere. We're gonna go ahead and get these stuffed animals put away. I am using those bins from Ikea. I actually used these in Victoria's room too when I organized her room last week. I will have that video in the description box below for you guys if you want to check that out. I think that these bins were like seven or eight dollars. Ikea really does have some awesome organizing things if you want to get your house organized. Now I'm gonna go ahead and organize Owen's books. Let me know in the comments, how do you guys store your kids books? We have so many more books and I have kind of an idea of what I want to do, but let me know in the comments what you guys do and if you guys have any tips or tricks. Myself, I have told you many times now. 
Yeah, can't you see that I just need to be by myself? I have told you many times now, but somewhere. So I'm going to be placing the bigger toys into this bin. So here is what we have for right now. I am going to stop the camera and go ahead and work with the things that are in the hallway, get those cleaned up, and here is the after. It's looking so much better. So we are going to go ahead and start some actual cleaning. I am going to be using that Method All-Purpose Cleaner again to wipe down Owen's furniture. Looking for a new So now we're going to go ahead and move on to vacuuming. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and move his bed back, then I'm going to be putting some of the stuff underneath the bed. I do like to store some of his bigger toys underneath his bed. So now I'm going to go ahead and clean his carpets and some of my clips did come out super blurry so there's only just a little bit of the carpet cleaning in here and then I'm also going to be cleaning Victoria's carpet so make sure to stay all the way to the end. So 
So I did make some labels with my Cricut Joy to put on the containers that I organized the dinosaurs in and all of the other little small toys. Stepped into my life, such a magic feeling. We tore down my walls. I wish I could go back to right before you told me I try to change it all. But look at us now, could have gone so far. It hurts to realize we're parted. Yeah, look at us now, this is who we are. And I just know things will never be the same We're like strangers again, again, again Strangers again, again, again We're like strangers again, again, again I just know things will never be the same We're like strangers again Tried much harder, now all we have are scars. You said we'd get so high, higher up than heaven. You said we'd reach the stars. But look at us now, we could have gone so far. It hurts to realize we're parted. Yeah, look at us now, this is who we so this was later on, Owen's sheets were finally finished and the carpet was pretty dry, so I'm going to go ahead and make his bed. Strangers again, again, again. Like strangers again, again, again. I just know things will never be the same. Like strangers again. Started. It's time to get my head up again You said that you had to I'll try to forget you Just didn't think we'd end up this way Like strangers again So here is how Owen's room came out. We are going to be starting with the closet and it looks so much better. I am honestly so happy with how everything came out. And here are the containers just with all of the little toys in them. I feel like they look so good and it'll be easy for him to be able to put them away and get the toys out that he wants. Then we have just some little costume stuff and his wood toys. And then we have some books and other little small toys and here we have actually an empty bin and some nerf guns and here is his room looks so much better so nice and clean So now we are quickly just going to pick up Victoria's room. There is really not much to do in here. I am going to be cleaning her carpets, but other than that, we just have a few things to do in here. What we do is what we do. 
So I also picked up this super cute little basket while I was at Ikea and this blanket is from Target and I'm just going to be putting a few of the baby dolls and stuffed animals in here. So now that I'm finished vacuuming, I am going to go ahead and start cleaning her carpets. Alright guys, that is pretty much it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like. And if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you guys enjoyed this decluttering, let me know in the comments so I know that you guys are enjoying this type of content. I have a new video every Tuesday and Saturday and I would love to bring you guys along on this YouTube journey. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!